Doing a quick review for the test modular bag for the back of your UTV. Uh, it's nice and big. I like the size of it. Insulation is god awful. Um, it has, comes with two saddlebags. They get strapped in right through there. These work really good. Never come off. I never have any problems. Like I said, you got two of them, but I only run one because I don't. I don't need two. But anyways, uh, insulation is terrible. Second thing about these, these straps are, are terrible too. Um, already, this is my second bag. My first one made it uh, two rides at Dumont Dunes, just riding, and three of the straps broke. I heard it flopping around a lot. So, and then uh, they sent me a second one, and that made it one trip to Dumont on the backside of the North Pole of the comp, riding through the, the whoops pretty hard, and broke these two straps now. So that's kind of my own fault, slash their fault. It's a cheap bag. So I would highly suggest if you go with this bag to uh, put in um, bungee straps or something over the top or strap it down so it doesn't flop around because it can't handle it as, as you can see. And I don't have probably more than 20 pounds in here, if that. And uh, so what, I, what I'm going to do now, I read through the forms. This is an option you can do if you're in this situation where you're, they're ripped and you don't want to spend $350, $400 for a stupid plastic one, hard case. This is... Uh, what I'm going to do is washers, big thick washers, I'm going to put it through uh, the bag, you know, down through the frame there, and hope that should hold a lot better, and then, like I said, for the insulation, it's terrible, it, it melts your ice quickly, and uh, all that good stuff, so this is what I end up getting from Home Depot. That's thickness, there's the protection shield, or reflective shield, whatever you want to call it, and uh, I'm going to give that a try. And uh, a lot of people said it works amazingly, a lot better. So I will do an install video how I'm going to do this. And uh, then I'll do, I'm riding this weekend up in Mount Charleston. So I will do a review after that on how well the back held up. Because I'll, I'll probably try to ride real hard and see how, see how it holds up. Anyways, I um, hope this helps you on your purchase. Um, it can be a good bag if you, have to, if you don't care to wrap everything up in plastic and bungee it down. Um, it's a bag for you. If you want to spend extra money so you don't have to do all that shit, and then spend extra money. But uh, that's my review, and if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.